Hi friends and welcome to my channel. Hello if you're new here, my name is Bells and today as you can see from the title, I really want to go into just finding your scents and tips and tricks that I've learned to help me smell better for the smell and fragrances that I wear to last longer, how I'm able to buy fragrances online, believe it or not, and how I'm able to just find fragrances that suit my personality and me and represent me well and suit my many moods. So if you're interested in this video, please keep on watching. Thank you to Penn Halligans for sponsoring today's video. I'm super, super excited. So let's get straight into building your own scent. Okay, let us begin. I hope you have got a notepad and pen because we're gonna be taking notes, okay? I don't know if I should have my ear, hair behind my ear. Is that a vibe or does that look school teacherish? Maybe I'll have some hair. So if you didn't already know, Pen Halligans is a luxury British brand which have some of my favorite, 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 favorite fragrances. We will get into them, okay? And oh, I'm so excited. Okay, I am so excited to just explain everything. Tip number one, okay? Very, very key tip. You need to figure out what scent do you like. It can be anything from fresh scent, fresh cotton or linen, or do you like the smell of maybe something like food, so like a cake, do you like the smell of that, or vanilla, um, cinnamon, something like that, or anything fruity, do you like strawberries, do you like lemon, or something zesty and citrusy. There is such a huge family, and I'd say the easiest way for you to find out is if you have any fragrances that you really like, find out the notes of them. I've done a video on my perfume collection and a lot of people are like, I don't really understand notes. And it can be complicated, but I'm gonna really simplify it for you guys. So, you have top notes, you have your middle or heart notes, and you have your base notes with almost every fragrance. So the top note it tends to fade, but it's the, it's your first impression of a scent. And sometimes I find that um, a lot of scents I really do like are quite overpowering at first, and I don't really like the top note. So the first thing I smell might be a bit much, but I like to leave it on my skin and just kind of let the warmth of my body chemistry, because that, um, that has a big effect on how it will sit on your skin. And throughout the day, I see how a scent smells. I Most of the time, I like how a scent smells towards the end of the day, rather than when I first wear it. I have got the Pen Halligans, the Bewitching Yasmin, which is one of the first fragrances I've ever smelled from Pen Halligans, and it's one that I just instantly liked from the get-go. So the Bewitching Yasmin has is an oriental fragrance with jasmine, incense, and oud. So definitely more warm, a very cozy, quite a sweet scent. For me, the first thing I smelled was kind of like the warmth and sweetness. Yeah, I, I really like warm scents as well. Like scents that should really be for like winter because a lot of, there's also seasons, but I just, for me it's timeless. I like warm, I like oody scents. Um, and then the, the, the middle or heart note, it's mainly heart note because it's like up to like 40 to 80% of the actual fragrance is a middle note. So that's why I would also say tip number two, if you like, if you're figuring out if you like a scent, give it some time. Give it some time. First impressions, like I said, I don't always like a scent off the bat, but give it maybe an hour and let it sit and like work with my skin and warm up. Um, then I figure out if I like a scent. The middle note is always gonna be the massive indicator if you really like a scent or, no, or, or not. And then the base note, is basically what is lingering after, the lingering scent. Um, the stronger the base, usually the better the perfume. Um, a lot of scents are really good for maybe a couple of hours, but the base scent isn't strong enough to really carry it around. Like, I've got coats and that have had perfume that I've probably put on like probably a week ago and I can still smell it, even over two weeks. I can, I can pick any of my jackets now and I can probably s smell most likely a Pen Halligan scent if I put it on still a week or two later. And I don't want this to be too overwhelming because I like a lot of scents. I've got a whole tray of scents back here with whatever mood I'm in because I'm a very moody person. So I go off of how I feel. I'm very open-minded as well, so I'm definitely down to try different things. And your signature scent can just be fun to figure out. It doesn't need to be, you need to find one perfume 
something that works for you. But if you find a family, then you can work and experiment around that family because you'll know you're always like it. Like me, it's more woody, fruity scents. Woody because it's warm and then fruity because it's just got that sweetness to it that I quite like. I feel like it's a bit of me. A bit of me, okay? <laughs> to make the experience of finding your signature scent more fun, Penhaligons actually have a fragrancing profiler on their website so you can figure out what your scent is. I don't know what it is about me though. I love a quiz, a little questionnaire. Let me figure out about myself. If it's a questionnaire to do with my personality or something like that, I'm gonna do it, I don't know why. I just have to figure out. I, I wanna know what you know about me, like the website, and figure out if it's true or, or not. So, I'll do the question with you as we go along so I'll click for her what type of scent do I want do I want day evening or versatile to be honest I need a few more day scents what can I make it off versatile what do you like to feel when you wear your fragrance inspired confident sensual elegant oh I like to feel confident, like I like a scent that makes me feel bossy and oh you know what, let me just tell you guys about my favourite, 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 favourite scent, like this makes me feel like an absolute boss, you know I'm going to put it on, I'm going to put it on for you guys, like I love the Yasmin, the, I love the Yasmin fragrance, but this makes me feel really feminine, I really like it, however, this just makes me feel like a boss, like if you are into men's fragrances, I think you'd really like this. Like, if you like Woody. Oh my gosh. Hang on, I need to finish the questionnaire. <gasps> it's it's so good. It's, uh, we'll find the, let me smell myself. It's just bossy. I feel like, I think I, I, I put a bit too much. Oh, also guys, when you, whenever you put on fragrances, don't rub, tap, just, just tap. Don't rub it in. It ruins the body chemistry and can change the scent and it just can wear it off easy if you just like rub. It's just, I don't know what it is. I cringe when I see other people do it. I used to do it loads until I found out and now, whoa, I put a little bit too much, but can it be, I'm, I'm, I'm at home. Can it be too much? This is a, this I wear on my special occasions. But yeah, sorry, back to the questionnaire. <laughs> Let me continue. Okay, excellent. Now fancy a getaway. What's your ideal destination? Ooh, I love a beach. I love a beach. Delightful. Perhaps something to quench your thirst. I love juice from on a beach. Which fabric is most appealing to you? Cotton, silk, denim or leather? Or oh, tweed or velvet? I'm a cotton babe. I just find it's breathable, you know? Do I like oriental, fresh, woody, or floral scents? Um, hmm, this is a bit tricky. See, this is what I mean, like, sometimes it's like, it depends on the mood. Okay, if I'm, if I'm traveling, I'll probably go for an oriental scent. Exquisite, we're nearly there. Which one appeals to you, spicy or serene? I like spice in my scents, like, cinnamon, herbal, all of those. Ooh, it says, you will think you'll love the inguine. Cousin floral. Ooh, head notes are broxen, citrus is a heart note, and base is a musk. I'll be, oh, I wanna try that. Dang. Last time I did this, I got um, Luna. I got Luna scent. And that's the thing, I'm so like moody, so it depends on my mood. <laughs> I won't always answer the same thing. But I got the Luna fragrance, and this one is lovely. Like, I haven't really got the fresh fragrances that I really like, but I feel like this is the perfect, mm, it's, it's fresh. Like if you like fresh scents, I can't think of maybe fresh floral scents. Oh, I just spat at you, I'm really sorry. Fresh floral scents, why is that tongue twister? <laughs> You'd really, really like this. And I just love the packaging, like all the packaging, I'm gonna show you guys, just all have a little ribbon, a little bow. The packaging is so cute of everything. This one's so nice. Reading notes for me is like having the subtitles on when watching a show. Like sometimes, yeah, you understand it, but when you see the subtitles, it's like you really hear all the words. So going back to the notes always feels like going to like subtitles, so. Luna also has Jasmine, which I like, and which is also in the B. Thank you. 
It also has Jasmine, which is the same as the Bewitching Jasmine I showed you guys. Bewitching Jasmine, Bewitching Yasmin, I showed you guys earlier. So when you can actually find scents you like and you can pick up notes, a lot of the time you can see the notes inside it. And it's also a good indicator to figure out if you're like a dupe and you don't always have to spend the large amount. But for me, scents like pen hangers, I find that they last so long with me. Um, I get loads of compliments all the time, all the time. In fact, Ade, my boyfriend, literally wants my fragrances. He thinks we're sharing. We're not sharing. We're not sharing. Okay, these aren't mine. This is my daytime scents. And don't, don't be alarmed. Okay, my scents, I haven't really used them because I am not going anywhere. But outdoors is opening. I literally have just been recovering from a foot surgery. So I've had all these scents just waiting to be used. However, the one that I have got the most use out of and which is on display is the Cairo. This is my everyday scent, to be honest, out of all of them. Like, I've used it a little bit, as you can see. I don't know. But Cairo, fan favourites. I think Helfetti and... Um, Kyra a big favorite. I really love this scent. If you follow Melissa's wardrobe on Instagram, you probably already know that she loves this scent. And she said she loved this scent, and I was like, you know what? I feel like, what? Well, that's another thing. If I find someone, an influencer that likes the type of scents I like, I'm just like, you know, I'm really here. So she really liked this scent, and I was like, so excited to try this. Love it. It's, it smells of money. Just, just money. Just. That's what it smells of. Think of you're in Dubai or you're in, yeah, you're in Dubai, you're about to splurge, you've got an all-inclusive and you're about to go out for dinner. So you put this on. It's just, I'm gonna tell you what scents at the end of the video I think you should get. Of course these are luxury scents. Pen Hannigans have been around for like 154 years. So they're, they're, they're big boys in this game, okay? They know luxury and they have experimented so wrong, so well. Oh, my room smells so nice. It smells so good, I can't, I can't even. A new scent that I'm excited to wear out to brunch. I've got brunch tomorrow, I'm gonna wear this. I'm gonna be wearing the Penhaligans of Babylon. Ah, this, the boxes, can, can we just talk about the boxes? The packaging, the thought, the detail to everything, you know, it's not a luxury for no reason, guys. It's got warm vanilla, which it smells absolutely divine. If you like warm, cozy scents, I know this will probably get worn more during winter time, and the Luna fragrance will probably get worn summertime um, so fragrances can also be seasonal i like luna during the summer it's fresher scents just tend to be a lot more bolder in the summer because your body is body temperature rises however um cozy scents because your body gets cold during the winter warm scents just bring back that warmth back to you i hope i'm making sense i really really hope i am a um, more wintry war autumn fragrance for me however like i said i'll wear something if i'm in the mood to wear it okay a season in define me but that's what I would reach to more if that makes sense and I want to make this as clear as possible if I haven't already please know that your scent is personal to you okay I I don't know how I feel about people you know having like top five fragrances for women or top five fragrances for men honestly all of that is bull whatever you find the sexiest scent in wear it okay me and like I said, I'm very moody. I'm, mo I'm very moody. I could do both, but yeah, I wanted to make that clear because honestly, scent is very, very personal. What you like, someone else might not like, and that is their business. That is not your business. Okay, if you like it, I love it. That's how it should be, basically. And that leads me into another tip to make your scent last longer. You can actually use a scent, um, a scented body wash or moisturizer, 110% moisturizer. You've got it in the bag, it's gonna last longer. So I've also got this bath set, which is the Juniper Sling Body and Hand Wash as well as Body and Hand Lotion. Love the little lotion. My hands are nice and clean, by the way. 
Mm. This is Zephyr Zesty. If you like, um, like lemongrass, citrusy scents, this is. It smells like outside, but in the best way possible. Like if you love nature, floral scents, this is a bit of you. And I've also got a favorite scent. This is also a big, 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 big fave. And also, if you wanna save money and figure out if a scent really works for you, get the body lotion, see how it lingers on your skin. It's cheaper, you know, you can also do samples. I know Penhaligons are doing samples soon. If not, I have it on the screen. Are they doing it soon? I'm sure they are. If you just wanna try out and see, or if you wanna gift, this is a really good gift, as well as discovery sets. If you don't know what scents you, you like, or the or the person you're gifting to, and you just want them to kind of smell a bit of everything, the Discovery sets are available. I'll have them up on the screen if I can, probably here. So you guys can try that out and just see what you like. It's a sample scent. So once again, it's saving a coin because these fragrances definitely like, like they're like around 200 pounds. They are like a lot to commit to. So definitely getting bath sets as well as discovery sets to make sure you really like the scents as well as the profiling questionnaire to figure out what scent is for you. So definitely moisturize and layer. Um, if you find that maybe the scent that you like a lot of people are wearing, which can be the case, definitely mix. I'm all about mixing scents. So like I said at the end of the video, I will give you guys my top three. Okay, my top three definitely would be Halfetti fragrance. I love the Cairo. And if I have to go top three, top three, top three. I do love the Yasmin, but I'll probably would go with Luna simply because it's a fresher scent so more daytime whereas Cairo I'd say it's a bit more versatile but probably evening but Halfetti is definitely an evening scent so I've got my three range. Honourable shout out to the Bewitching Yasmin and the Babylon fragrance which are both warm and very much my scent. These are my top three and if you wanted to know what is my signature scent out of all of them i would probably go with cairo it's just a bit even matches with the vibe it's just it's 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 just me so i would say out of all of them just because this one it's it's a statement it's a statement like they're all statements in their own way how is definitely gorgeous but this is like a special occasion i can't wear this out when I'm just doing like errands and stuff whereas this I can wear with whatever I'm gonna get compliments regardless it's like my versatile scent even though it probably is worn like evening but it just oh, it just looks expensive it is expensive <laughs> But that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found it useful. Let me know if you have any other questions down below in the comments. And thank you once again to Pen Halligans for sponsoring this video. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. It's probably gonna be a vlog. I think it's gonna be a vlog. Anyway, catch you guys next time. Mwah. Bye.